so welcome back to another uh, video of Makwal Agri. So right now I'm actually uh, going to the store where I buy the whole chicks. So I'm going there to collect my my the old chicks that are coming in today. So I was supposed to collect um, 200. Unfortunately, they told me stories and then uh, they cancelled uh, one box and they said that the HRE uh, has um, limited them to to give them uh, uh, the boxes that they've promised them. So yeah, those are some of the challenges that we come across in in this journey of trying to uh, become a prayer farmer. So you'll find that um, when you, you place the order, your order get cancelled. I remember last year during festive season, uh, my orders were also cancelled. So I couldn't actually um, work uh, throughout the festive season. So even now, it's still the same thing. It's now around Easter time. So actually, we are preparing a circle for our Easter weekend. And it seems like uh, we're going to be facing the same or we're going to be facing the similar uh, problem. So, yeah. But I'm hoping that uh, everything will make sense. Uh, yeah. So now let's go and, and collect our day old chicks. So the, the prices that I pay for this day old chick that I'm collecting today, it was around... Um, it was around 1250 so that was the cost price of actually buying um, 100 day old chicks so this means that a, a chick uh, a day old chick cost uh, 1250 uh, for each so yeah that's the cost now and I'm getting another 200 uh, next week so what I did because I wanted to, to, to do like uh, more numbers now so what I did is that after they cancelled one box I went to the other store and bought uh, two boxes uh, luckily they still had a slot because remember when you buy chicks you first go in you book and then they will tell you when your chicks will come so normally it takes about uh, five days before you can actually uh, get your chicks but if sometimes you can book in, like in advance let's say you can book for the next month to, to actually uh, secure a spot because uh, more especially during festive season if you, you you try to book late you may find that uh, everyone is, is fully booked so during festive season you just have to try and book it earlier but uh, around around the mid-year time uh there's no need for you to actually book um uh, 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 like a month before you can book any time most of people get lucky uh you you find that uh, they still have uh, space because the demand is low but anyway yeah right now we are actually on our way to get our 200 uh no 100 the old chicks so we're gonna be getting 200 uh next week yeah uh, man yeah it's, so before I left, um, <coughs> before I left my chicken house, I made sure that my light are on to actually um, heat up uh, the place. So you need to actually provide heat for, for, for your chickens before they arrive. So when, when your chicken arrive in your chicken house, they should find that um, the temperature in the chicken house is suitable uh, for them. Uh, but plus today's weather it's it's actually uh bad man like it's kind of cold outside it's kind of cloudy and i hate i hate uh, actually uh studying a circle on a weather like this because it means you need to provide like enough 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 uh, um thing and enough um temperature for your, your chickens man so yeah basically i love studying my circle on uh, sunny days you know that i know that it's too hot so i don't need to actually stress about heating up the, the thing the brood uh, heating up my chicken house and stuff so but yeah today it's kind of cloudy i hope maybe during the day uh, the cloud will go away because this is an important man it's 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 almost uh, hot the whole year so if, even if today maybe it's like this tomorrow we wake up and it's a sunny day so yeah i mean uh, and I, 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 I love collecting my chicks uh using a, a, a private car like this one um i don't like use i don't like collecting them using a buggy i see some people will put their chicks uh, at the back of the buggy and when you drive let's say you're driving like 40 kilometers from where you collect your chicks but for me it's like uh three kilometers or two kilometers not far from my house anyway so if you're collecting from far imagine how how messed up things will be um like the the air that will be flowing at the back of your buggy and like your chicks will be feeling cold sometimes when you get home you may probably may find that two or three chicks are lost uh, along the way so you need to collect your chicks uh, in a 
in a good car man like you know that uh it's it's secured there's no flow of air that's coming from outside and so on and so on so the temperatures also are good so i'm almost there at the shop uh yeah man let's let, let's go and collect these chicks man um we just uh collected our chicks so i'm now driving back um taking them to the chicken house so where they will be raised um yeah so they are there at the back seat there's a box at the back so those are packs of about 100 chicks inside the box so we are gonna, we're gonna begin our 200 uh, next week so yeah i'm trying to raise 300 this time scaling it up uh, I don't have much to say, man. Um, let's go to the chicken house and see how things uh, are. So, done. our chicken have arrived in, in the house. Um, so, what you basically do is to check a uh, few things before you take them in. So, if you have a scale, obviously you want to scale your chicks and check if the weight is around um, 44 grams. And then another thing that you check is you check if they are vaccinated. So to see that your chicks are vaccinated, you will see by this uh, purple color or greenish color that you see on them. So that means that your chicks are being vaccinated. But otherwise, everything looks good. So now we're going to be taking them to our brooder and we're going to be starting raising our chicks. Let's go. Uh, so now our chicken are inside our brooder and they're really looking active so yeah they're drinking stress pack and they're also eating starter as their feed so we're gonna be having an incredible one so there are hundred of them hope you won't lose anything 